You see the Blue Devil, and he's getting set to move out against uh, Dave Fields. One fall, 10-minute time limit. Now, we had an opportunity the past couple of weeks to see this Blue Devil in action. He is a tremendously impressive-looking uh, competitor. Now, Dave Fields is uh, a good, solid-looking young man. So the Blue Devil backing away. Fields closes in. It's the Blue Devil. And they're into the turnbuckle and a forearm across the chest by the Blue Devil on the Fields. Fields caught again in the chest. Two hard percussions to the chest. And a knee lift that drives uh, Fields back to the canvas once again. And so the Blue Devil apparently is very much in control of the situation. Fields caught in a snap mare and driven back to the canvas again. And it is the Blue Devil controlling the uh, head of uh, Dave Fields. And of course, when you control the head, you control the rest of the body. Certainly no question about that. Where the head goes, the body goes. All right, the Blue Devil, wide stance over the shoulder, step over on the uh, left arm, a forearm into the uh, throat and chest area of Dave Fields once again. Now back into a snap mare. And it is uh, Fields again in a lot of trouble. Notice the uh, symmetrical muscular definition on this man, the Blue Devil. Extremely powerful uh, quadricep femoris muscle. Good latissimus dorsi. He is uh, unquestionably a man who has spent many, many hours in bodybuilding and in training. Fields, by the way, uh, lighter weight, but certainly no slouch if you take a look at the mus muscular definition and confirmation on this man. Referee Nick Patrick watching it carefully now. Snap mare that takes field back to the canvas once again. In the ring. Get in the ring right now. One. And it is... Uh, Keep it open. That's right. Come on, you want to stop? You want to stop? And it's the Blue Devil. Come on, Come into the back and once again drives the knee into the back of uh, Dave Fields. Fields in a lot of trouble. A Russian sickle now by the Blue Devil. That may give us some hint as to his background. And I'm beginning to believe that his background must be relatively European uh, because of his very style once he moves into the ring. He has a lot of the uh, European uh, characteristics uh, in competition. By the way, nice to have the Jones Boys Club with us here today. Vernon Miller in charge. And uh, they had all those good folks in Charleston, West Virginia. Trina and all of the other good folks over there. Rick Lassiter uh, commenting to me about uh, all of those folks in Charleston. Say hi to our friends at Wheeling as well. Speaking of West Virginia, we appreciate the Cardinals. We got Fields in a lot of trouble now. Coming up, fired with everything that he had, but he doesn't have much left. Uh, forearm that was very, very ineffectual. Fields all but uh, out on his feet, and uh, the Blue Devil has completely and totally dominated him. Fields beginning to find out that. Uh, He's really in the wrong league when he has stepped out there. Uh-uh. And the referee, Nick Patrick, kindly asking Fields if he wants to concede. Fields, remarkably stubborn, does not. Gets a side headlock, but uh, the Blue Devil took care of that. Belly to back, uh, Souffle and Fields in a lot of trouble. And once again, the Blue Devil closing in on him. And it looks like he's gone for a variation of the Cobra. He has. He's gone for a variation of the Cobra. And it'll be all she wrote. No way he's going to get away from that. And uh, he's out. He's out. And so the Blue Devil is victorious.